everyone, thank you for joining me today. My name is Erin Muffaletto and I work for Comcast. Today we are going to be reading E is for Enchantment. It is a New Mexico alphabet. And this is my puppy Chauncey and Pepper is down here too. So in case you see them, see them in the screen, that's who they are. <laughs> All right, this is written by Helen Foster James and it's illustrated by Niecy Twinnum. Now this book can actually be really long but we're going to read the um, short version. And if you're interested in reading the extended version, you can go ahead and go to your local bookstore and check it out. All right, let's get started. So A is for the ancient ones who long ago in history abandoned homes, now crumbling ruins, and left us with a mystery. B is for Smokey Bear a black bear from our state. You'll see his picture everywhere on signs that educate. C is for Carlsbad Caverns, discovered by cowboy Jim White. This amazing maze of limestone caves is truly an amazing sight. D is for the storyteller doll, created out of clay with children gathered on her lap to hear what all she will say. E, our nickname is Land of Enchantment. And enchantment starts with an E. When viewing a desert sunset, enchanted you surely will be. <laughs> F is for Indian fry bread, on my list as a favorite food. If you made a list of your favorites, which foods would you include? <laughs> G, for the glory and glittering gold wanted by Spanish explorers of old. They journeyed here a long time ago and named our land New Mexico. H is for hot air balloons that rise high in the sky. See their colors and funny shapes? Come and watch them sailing by. I is for inscription rock. It soars 200 feet. For pioneers, it meant fresh water and welcome shelter from the heat. J will be for jewelry. Such beautiful things to wear. Sterling silver with turquoise gems, finely crafted with great care. <laughs> Let's make K for Coca Pelli, a figure scratched upon a rock. With other ancient petroglyphs, these rock cravings seem to talk. <laughs> L is for Los Alamos, where scientists work to find the secrets of atomic worlds to benefit mankind. M is for missions, some big and some small, Many are short, while others are tall. Stately and highly are humble and low, all of them treasured by people we know. N is for natural resources of copper and uranium ore, and glistening gypsum crystals in dunes of the desert floor. <laughs> Georgia O'Keeffe was an artist and O Keefe begins with an O. She found her inspiration when she saw New Mexico. P is for the Pueblo villages from long ago and still today. Adobe homes give shelter with their bricks of straw and clay. Q is almost always found with partner letter U. Look closely at the city's name and see if this is true. Albuquerque, <laughs> which has two Qs in it. R is for our restress. Sun-dried chilies on a string. They welcome, or they warn you, and they make your taste buds sing. <laughs> S is for Old Santa Fe, a wonderful place to vacation with Spanish and Mexican history 
It's the first capital in our nation. A train, a tram, and a turquoise trail, they all begin with T. So take a trip and look around at all the sights you'll see. You could be for UFOs with aliens, friend or foe. Did life from far off planets really land here long ago? <laughs> v for Vaquero, the cowboy, riding herd on his cattle and sheep. And sometimes, of course, as he rides on his horse, you can hear as he sings them to sleep. <laughs> w is for this pretty wasp. But tarantula beware, that's our state's official insect. I knew from over there. <laughs> X can be for xeriscaping, an agricultural art. Growing plants with little water is creative and also smart. Y is for the yucca. Children knew that it was great, so they voted and decided on this flower for the state. <laughs> And Z, Z is for the Zia sun. It's on our flag we love, radiant points on a yellow field, proudly waving up above. That is it. Well, I hope you all enjoyed this book as much as I do. I know my nieces and nephew really love this one. So if you're interested in reading more about it, go check it out. Um, and thank you all for joining. See you next week on Lavender Libros. <laughs> Bye.